as far as the entire Parambir Singh case is uh, concerned. It is, in fact, the issue of Sachin was a reinstatement. Parambir Singh has uh, given a statement before the ED and he says there was direct pressure from Anil Deshmukh to reinstate Sachin Waze. He has further said that I also got instructions from Aditya Thakre and Uddhav Thakre. Waze briefed me about expectation by Deshmukh for collection of 100 crore rupees. I advised him to not succumb under pressure. Big development coming in from Mumbai. Let's go across to Radhika to put this in the right perspective for us. Radhika, take us through the details of which case this is. And uh, suddenly now Paramveer Singh dropping a bombshell by naming the Thakres. It's perhaps for the first time that they name appears to have come on record in this particular uh, matter in this way. That's right. This is the first time that Parambir Singh, in his statements before any agency, has named the Chief Minister of Maharashtra or, in, for that matter, Aditya Thakre. Now, this is a statement he recorded before the Enforcement Directorate, and this is with respect to Anil Deshmukh case. As far as the money laundering allegations of Anil Deshmukh is concerned, uh, uh, you know, procedurally, Parambir Singh had to be called in because it was based on his letter that the case itself uh, uh, was uh, registered a, a while later. Now, this was something that he had recorded. Uh, in the month of December. I'm just going to read out from this 12-page statement uh, that he had made uh, before the enforcement director. It states, in this regard, I state that Sri Sachin Vaze was reinstated in the month of June 2020 after review meet where all the, uh, the case of suspensions were reviewed by a committee headed by uh, CP Mumbai, some joint CP and other senior officials. And then he goes on to say that I would like to state that there was from Anil Deshmukh for his reinstatement. I also got direct instructions from Sri Aditya Thakre and uh, uh, Honorable Chief Minister Sri Uddhav Thakre. I got similar instru instructions for his posting to crime branch of Mumbai Police and also for he giving him charge of some important unit there. So here he very categorically in his statement where he was asked the question on Sachin Vazi stating that that was not a call that Parambir Singh took because we know for a fact that there were allegations, there were talks during the rounds that it was Parambir Singh who had reinstated him. In these statements, he's making it clear that it was not him, but it was Anil Deshmukh. It was, uh, you know, under the behest of Chief Minister of Maharashtra and also Aditya Thakre, he, whose instructions who, had who he had taken directly. Now, there is one more mention where he says that I would like to add here that Sachin Vaze was being directly called by Honorable Chief Minister and Honorable Home Minister for briefing and receiving instructions for further course of action. So this is with respect to a case under his charge in uh, CIU. So basically what is ha what uh, uh, you know Parambir Singh in his statements to Enforcement Directorate is reinforcing that you know most of the uh, you know corruption allegations uh, that were leveled against him is something that he was not in the know-how of. He did not give any direct, direct right. instruction to Sachin Vaze. It were the ministers, be it the Home Minister or, and, and now, uh, you know, the, the name of Chief Minister itself surfacing, saying that under their instructions, uh, one, he was reinstated and as far as cases within the CIU where uh, Sachin Vaze was an officer is concerned, even those instructions were taken directly by these ministers well, very, from Sachin very Vaze important himself. important statement indeed and this is sure to spark off a massive controversy there. Radhika, we will have to look at the reactions that come into this particular story, politically speaking, from the various political quarters. Uh, but certainly, of course, uh, most important will be what the Shiv Sena has to say as far as this particular allegation is concerned. Thanks so much, Radhika, for bringing us all those breaking details.